What's up guys, it's King Josh back with another video and today I'm going to show you guys all of my animations. On that Big Man Dribble Moves video, I asked for 30 likes and you guys gave me 40. So here's this video for you guys. I'm going to show you guys all my animations. To start, my jump shot is base 49 and release 1 and release 2 are both Larry Bird and I do use Hall of Fame Quick Draw on that. My free throw is Kobe Bryant. I've been using that free throw since NBA 2K16 so I can time it really well. It's really easy to time. For dribble pull-ups, I was actually looking yesterday because I didn't really know any good dribble pull-ups, but I tried out Stephen Curry, and this is easily the best dribble pull-up in the game. If you don't like this one, you should try Normal 2. Normal 2 is very good, but it's not that consistent, and the Steph Curry dribble pull-up is very consistent, so I think this one is the best. For my spin jumper, I use Normal 4. I tried out Normal 8, but I don't really like it, and Normal 4 is a little bit slow, but it is very effective and easy to time. For hop jumpers, I think normal 14 is the best, especially if you have a high three-pointer, because sometimes it does pull you far behind the line, but it does create a ton of space. For my post fade, I have fade three, that's easily the best fade. For post hook, I also have hook three, it doesn't really matter that much because I don't do hooks too much. So honestly, I'm not 100% sure if that is the best one. For post hop shots, I have post hop shot one on, this is easily the best in my opinion, but if you end up not liking this one, I would try out post hop shot seven, eight, and ten, those are also good. And for my post shimmy fade and shimmy hook, I just have three, those don't really matter as much. If you guys didn't see my dribble moves video from before, here are all my dribble moves. I have Paul George dribble style. I think that one is probably the best one for big men. My size of package is normal four. Moving crossover normal three is easily the best. For behind the back, I think normal two and normal three are the best one, but I like normal two a little bit more. For moving spins, basic one is the best because there's some animation that you can get that's really good and it actually creates a lot of space. For my moving hesitation, I put normal two on. That one's also really good. And for my triple threat style, I use normal two. Last but not least, I'll show you guys my layout layups and dunks and as you can see I don't have many layups or dunks on because this big man that I'm using right now does not have a high driving dunk at all I think my driving dunk is a 44 or something like that so my layup package is default big that's the only one I can get and for my dunks I have rim graces off one and big man off one which are actually pretty good considering that my driving dunk is super low these are probably the best two dunk packages with a low driving dunk so that's gonna be it for my animations if you guys want to see this build make sure to let me know I do not have any gameplay of this build on my channel yet but I think this is gonna be my main build for NBA 2K20 I've been trying out a bunch of different builds I think I've tried out five now this is probably gonna be my my main big man one so make sure to get this video to 20 likes and i'll show you guys some gameplay of that build if you're new to the channel make sure to subscribe it's been king josh and i'm out